All right, we're taking our first attempt at difficulty four so far. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and help out Big Dog here. Don't know if he needs it, but I figure why not? No reason to leave notes behind and leave a man back. Um, might as well just keep pushing through. We are going for 60% this time, not 100. So uh, just trying to figure out, um, well, what exactly it'll take to 100 it. So um, I am spending raid heals on this. You know, you get plenty tweak from Blitz and from your uh, challenge rewards and all that. So no big deal there. I'm not too worried about it. Um, I'm willing to spend heals on this. Uh, I'm trying to avoid spending cores though, uh, just because I don't think it's worth it for a 60% finish. But I do want to see how far we can get, how hard it is, and uh, exactly how difficult uh, this is going to end up being. So we'll play it normal. And then let's see if we can get the Venom down. There we go. Get a little heal for Black Bolt there. And yeah, since this is clean up, it's going to be a little bit of odd turn orders, but that's fine. Um, let's go ahead and knock off that Iron Fist there. There's some energy back to him. I think probably um, Carnage is the most uh, powerful of this bunch. I generally don't need Maw's ult for a little while, and since we got six energy here coming our way, I figure I'll just waste it now, and slow them, and then see if I can get them down. Go before they get an attack. Uh, let's see if we can get Miles in the red and then knock him off. There we go. And we got one more energy to get his special back. And oh, he dodged. All right. Well, did a little bit of damage there, but not too much. So that's not so bad. Uh, Ma kills him with his force grip, force choke, <laughs> which is always fun. All right. So let's uh, keep on rolling here. Well, one thing I did notice in difficulty four, it's only 100 credits plus 10, so it's 110 credits of total raid credit per node, which I thought was weird because I'm pretty sure the event, like the, or not the event, the Greek raids give you like 130 per node. Uh, I'll have to check that after this, but let's keep moving on and uh, hopefully we got all of our abilities ready again, at least the important ones. <laughs> Uh, we'll keep on rolling here. So, uh, one thing is troopers do hurt, and so do punishers when you're running a lot of villains. Um, so you gotta pick one and, and subdue them uh, or limit their uh, ability to hurt you. So offense down is of course a big help. And then I really like just using the stun on punisher here to open and slow everybody. And then uh, we can focus down trooper and widow uh, before. Uh, Punisher gets another turn, should get her, oh, there goes Sniper, and now hopefully they use both these taunts before the next wave drops, yep, that's good, we'll focus the one with less health, because we could probably kill him, well, we'll just let the other one, even though he has a slow, maybe, maybe he'll uh, finish his turn, um, and get rid of that taunt on his own, we'll see, um, actually, it's probably going to be a while, let's go ahead and dispel it, and then we'll focus down this guy here, there we go. Oh, nice kill, Thanos. There we go. And the barrier from killing um, Widow because she is a controller. Uh, let's go ahead and throw D down on one of these rockets. Maybe both. Nice. And then we got to worry about this uh, Punisher coming up, too. Um, I think we'll put the offense down on Rocket real quick because we're going to taunt out of this. And then uh, let's kill Punisher here with the double tap. Oh, I thought that would kill him. Uh, that's okay, we got him there. And then here is the slows. And then we are going to put the defense down on these dudes, bounce back and forth. And oof. All right, let's see if we can get one rocket down at least. There we go, that's nice. That hurts. No D down on Thanos there, it's, it's gonna murder him. Uh, let's go ahead and try to keep him alive with his ult. Yeah, there he healed right back up. And then we got, ooh, Black Bolt ult. That's always useful, especially with all these tech characters out there. Ooh, yes, two tech characters down. All right. Um, we got six energy left on the board here for Thanos to generate. So whenever I'm in this situation, I always can be get, get concerned about using a five energy ability like this. I think these guys are both going to do their specials, and he's probably going to do his um, taunt. So I'm going to go ahead and leave them up. Uh, we'll just try to get this sniper down and hope that yeah he doesn't do too much damage to Thanos here 
and uh, should be a pretty clean finish. Uh, yep, there we go. Get a little bit, but we're gonna get another, you know, 25k or so from the Minerva heal from killing him. And uh, and look, ooh, Black Bolt's almost got his ult ready too, so that's very nice. And uh, oh, and he just got one more energy, so he should be good to go. And we save the Ebony Maw special for the next one, which is extremely important. Um, not having the Maw defense up on spawn is is one of the things that wrecks me in, in U7. Uh, but here we got the uh, second boss node. We've got uh, 150k characters, uh, so it looks pretty tough. Um, although I remember this, this particular node was never very difficult for me in difficulty 1, 2, or 3. So I'm not sure if it's going to be bad in 4, but one of the keys is to just leave the infectors up because they don't really do anything and just let them kind of do their thing in the corner because without other aim characters to help them they don't really do anything. Um, but it limits the amount of things that can kill you on the board. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and taunt with Thanos of course. We're going to use the special from Ebony Maw and then we may have to use Minerva's ult right off the bat. Um, yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and slow them. That's, I think, the, the right move here. Uh, even though I don't really need to stun Thanos. I don't really want to kill these guys too much right now and get the next wave. I want to slow play this a little bit. I want to get some health back for Thanos. Um, he's got death proofs. He'll heal up from his ult, uh, assuming he has it. Ooh. He's about to get a turn. Um, I don't want to waste the ult here. And we're about to get, we're about to get Thanos' turn. Let's, uh... Let's go for, yeah, let's see if we can get this Gamora down a little bit. And then, yeah, there we go. That should heal up quite a bit. Ooh, almost got him. All right. Uh, let's get this offense down off of Black Panther here. And there goes Gamora. She just took a nap. And then there's the ult from Black Panther. So that does a little bit of damage, but it's not too bad. I can at least withstand it. Uh, and then we're going to focus Racket down here. Uh, but we do have to worry about Drax coming back with his taunt, so that's going to mess up my ability to target certain characters here. Um, let's, uh, let's go for Rocket here, get him low. Should, ooh, it didn't kill him. Alright, let's take him out. And we got Panther really low. Ooh, he's not dead yet. Let's go for the special on Drax, see if we can get him down really low. There we go. And then killing Star-Lord is going to be a priority here. Um, because he provides that barrier, which is really nice. So we're going to go ahead and extend these debuffs on all these dudes. Uh, ooh, missed with the... Both the Spider-Mans dodged, dodged that. That sucks. And I have no cleanse to get rid of that disrupt. So, uh, shit. Alright, we need to kill Star-Lord pretty quick here. Yeah, see those infectors, if you just leave them alive, like I'm, I don't want to use his ult because I don't want to leave them... Uh, or I don't want to hurt them too much. Let's go ahead and heal up here because we don't have any, yeah, we don't have much else to do for heals. Uh, we'll just go ahead and yeah, slow everybody and then uh, let's go for Miles. He's about to use his slow. And see if we can get him in the red and get him tapped down. There we go. Nice heals. And then uh, let's get this Spider-Man down. There we go. Very nice. And uh, let's go ahead. Gamora is pretty powerful here, and she's fast. Let's go ahead and knock off that Star Lord, get the barrier going, and then we will uh, alt with Black Bolt here to do some big damage. Now that killed the Infectors, so that probably wasn't the best idea because <laughs> they are kind of your uh, book, uh, your your uh, uh, I don't know. They're like your bookends here for the enemies. Uh, wave drops. You just leave them up, and then. You know, nothing bad happens because <laughs> they don't do anything. But uh, that's okay. We'll fight through this just fine. All right, let's. Uh, we got the disrupt on Black Bolt, but that's okay. We're doing really good here. We're gonna get rid of that taunt. We're gonna focus down Panther here in a sec. Uh, let's go ahead and use this ult just to slow them. Make sure we don't get uh, wrecked by the Black Panther here. Just want to make sure we have. Uh, uh, we aren't going to get in this situation where they do a lot of damage and then we got to reheal too much. Uh, let's go ahead and use the special. I think that'll do enough to where... Oh, no, it didn't quite kill him. Man, that Thanos counter comes in handy a lot. A lot more than it should. All right, there we go. Now we can go for Black Panther. Uh, Miles is slowed, so it should be okay. Uh, this is going to hurt. Yeah, 81k right there. Let's get rid of that offense down and murder him. That's always good. Uh, Let's see, we need defense down on him. 
And I think we're okay to just slow play it here. Um, yeah, see, he hit Black Bolt, who had defense up. So we'll just, yeah, okay, that's an easy kill. <laughs> so I might have to heal Thanos here at the start, just so that he can uh, taunt right off the bat and not die. Uh, but that wasn't so bad. That was, that was fairly simple. Uh, just taking it easy with this team. Same team I used for uh, difficulty three. Um, and now here comes, this is the node I hate. Uh, so there's four things that can murder me and it's two Lokis and two Mystiques. And it's all about their, their make your, your teammates attack each other thing. Um, that is by far the most annoying thing about this node, but I'll give it a shot. Uh, Cause if Black Panther kills like Minerva right off the bat, then you're screwed. So I'm gonna heal up here keep on moving because we need to get through the third boss at least for 60 percent um, maybe do a little bit more because the guys in the middle might be having trouble um, because the middle lanes are just so much more difficult than the outside and plus you have generally only two people on those lanes instead of three so it does make a difference oh yes okay hit black bolt that's fine don't kill her please don't kill her black bolt thank you all right gonna taunt here hope nobody touches minerva for a little bit okay d up Offense down. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use the slow right away because we need to. And the ability blocks on the Jessica Jones are nice. The other thing about the Jessica Jones that's nice is that they uh, are controllers. So when you kill them, they uh, give you a uh, barrier with uh, Ebony Moss passive. So uh, we're going to keep on hitting this guy. We're gonna kill his Loki at least, get some heals. And uh, yeah, there we go. And now the new group is out. Uh, let's see if we can kill that Loki before he ults. Yeah, there we go. Oh man, didn't quite get that Jessica down, but let's see if we can knock her off. There we go. Get a little bit of heal. There's the barrier. That's what I was looking for. And uh, let's go ahead and get rid of this Jessica too. And then there we go. All right, now we got D up. We got, oh yes. All right, this is what we need. Let's do defense up on everybody once more. Offense down on them. And then, uh, yeah, we'll just have to eat those. Um, those mystique ults but i think thanos can take it and should be fine yeah oh good ma's like the perfect guy to hit him because he doesn't do anything <laughs> his basic is so weak we got immunities up on a few of them so that helps too uh oh black bolts dispel from his basic ouch uh that sucks but you know it happens what you gonna do all right uh let's go ahead and get this mordo down right oh almost ah man those heal blocks are annoying um let me see here. I can kill Mantis. I think I get the barrier back, right? She's a controller. Uh, let's go ahead and do this real quick. Hmm. I want the D down on that Juggernaut so I can hit him when he taunts here in a sec. Yeah. So that'll negate his D up. That'll give me a chance at getting through his resistance at least. And uh, hopefully. Ooh, yeah, let's just do that. Screw you guys. <laughs> look at that another barrier thank you i love these barriers like it's so nice of them to put these hero controllers in these nodes so that you can get your barriers back like <sighs> like little uh snack packs you know just look at all that extra health oh man it's super easy all right there we go let's uh crush that dude let's uh keep hitting her should kill her with the uh, Black Bolt passive. No, it didn't. But he's still got a little ways to go for his ult. So hopefully he gets some energy from the Thanos passive. Yeah, he got one. So that's good. He won't have his ult right away, but uh, turn two. So that works. Uh, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. So uh, part of it is very much luck right at the beginning. Whoever Loki picks. Like if he picks Minerva twice, then I'm screwed. If he picks Ebony Maw twice, I might be screwed. If uh, Black Bolt uh, basics him. So uh, next, oh, I should show it, um, sorry. The node is Chain Gang. Uh, so this one's usually not too bad. You just gotta make sure you wrangle in um, the Carnages and uh, I think, is this the one with the Daredevils? I think it's the one with the Daredevils. Those guys hit hard. Uh, so I'm gonna prioritize them most likely, uh, especially when they do that alt and just melee through your entire villain crew. Uh, yeah, well, I guess, Two of my guys are not villains, but whatever. You know what I mean. All right, let's do the alt or the special here, and then we'll do the uh, special from Maw. Give them all offense down. We're gonna do the slow again to start. That's this combo here to start makes everything so much easier. 
Um, and we're going to try to live through this without wasting a Nerva ult right now. Get rid of that taunt so we can focus the damage dealers like Gamora. I think Gamora is the most powerful uh, of this group here to start. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and get rid of those evades, put the slows on them. I'm going to go ahead and extend the uh, stun on Drax so we don't have to waste a whole bunch of damage to killing him. Uh, we're going to go ahead and ult here too because we're going to get a bunch of energy from these kills. And um, yeah, we'll kill. Ooh. Let's see, uh, he doesn't have beat out. Let's just get the Gamora out of the way. She does a lot of damage, surprisingly. Uh, she usually doesn't do much damage for me when I use her, but she definitely does a lot of damage for uh, the AI. <laughs> All right, let's knock this guy off. Uh, get rid of that Sabertooth. He can hit pretty hard into, uh, uh, into um, taunting characters. Let's see, and of course, Nebula is tech, so Black Bolt eats her alive. Uh, let's just go ahead and do this. Maybe we'll kill that Drax too while we're at it. Almost. Almost. But that's good. He's still stunned. That's fine with me. Like I said, we need to prioritize Daredevil. So we're going to put offense down on him and taunt here. And then we'll use the Black Bolt Holt and get some big damage. Uh, let's see. And there's the D up and offense down on everyone. Uh, let's put D down on him. Let's just keep going at him. There we go. Not bad. Yeah, Carnage can hit pretty hard if you don't have your defense up ready. Ooh, yeah. So can Daredevil. Don't kill him. Yeah, see, the defense stuff got uh, dispelled by the Black Bolt basic there. So now's the time to use this ult, get some health back, get some regens, uh, and then get some kills and get those passive heals, which is really where the big money is when it comes to healing with her. All right, let's see if we can get this Spider-Man. Almost. Um, let's just get it down. That's fine. It'll drop the next wave, I think. But oh man, almost get Carnage there. Um, can we? Well, she doesn't do too much damage. I can leave her. Let's uh, let's try to get this Daredevil. There we go. Oh man, he healed a bunch right there. Um, need to get Carnage out of here. Let's get small heal. Ouch, that hurts too. Uh, let's just do the D up because even if Thanos dies, I'll res him. That's fine. Uh, but the D up keeps them alive. And then we're gonna slow, or we're gonna, let's just stun uh, these dudes here. And then, ooh, let's see. No, oh, he got the D down from Spider Man's basic. Ouch. Uh, okay, we're gonna get rid of Daredevil. There we go. Bring back Thanos. And let's clear this Wolverine real quick. It's fine. And we'll do the Maw ult just to be safe, clear those evades, and then put slows and, and turn meter reduction on them. And then I think we have an Iron Fist ult coming, so I don't really want to get hit with that. Um, you know, let's just do the ult here, and we're going to get some energy back anyway, and uh, see if we can keep them alive. All right, so we're just basically slowly and methodically finishing this off. Uh, she's got that D up, which is going to make it hard to kill her. Uh, before she gets another turn. And it looks like she will. Yeah, there she did about 100,000 damage. And she's also got those uh, death proofs on her. But that's okay. It gave me a little bit more energy for Maw, so he'll have his ult sooner. And we'll see who gets the energy on this one. Uh, looks like one to Black Bolt and one to Maw. So that was a good split. Um, but yeah, that wasn't so bad at all. Um, I felt a little tougher than difficulty three, but not like insanely tough. Uh, that was 4.6 million, 3.6. Uh, 4.6, 3.3, and then 800k, and I did that one for 4 or 2, and yeah, it should be pretty top, pretty far up there, 25 million. Uh, not too bad, not too bad. So uh, we're doing pretty well, we got 45% so far. Um, you can see the guys in the middle are uh, hitting the uh, Fury node now, and then uh, these guys are a little bit behind because they're in Europe, so... Uh, they'll wake up in a little bit and keep on progressing, so we should be in good shape. But we've still got 13 hours to get to 60%. Uh, we're already at 45, so I think we're doing really well. If uh, Team 3 could, you know, get their shit together, then we'd probably be okay. Uh, but they got they got a ways to go. Um, yeah. Wow. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, well, at least they'll uh, they'll have some time to figure things out. <laughs> <laughs> Team 2 is doing really well, though. Look at these. Oh, and New I'm is already hitting uh, the Fury node in the middle there, so that's good. Uh, yeah, right side. Look at that. They already cleared through Vision. That's excellent. 
uh, for halfway through the raid, that's about where you want to be. So uh, we should be on track to uh, finish it up and uh, get 60 plus percent. Uh, just to show real quick here, um, if we go to Ultimus Raids and we go to uh, Enter the... Oh, that, oh, you can't view it? Ah, because it's already in progress. I can't view the uh, challenge slider that shows you all the uh, the uh, rewards, I don't think. Yeah, so in any case, uh, difficulty 2 gives about the same as like getting 100% on difficulty 3. So for going up a difficulty and making it a lot harder, you don't really get a whole lot out of it, um, which is kind of a shame, you know? Um, I wish they would bump this stuff up more. Even just raid credits would be nice because that's gear that I can buy or, you know, character shards. And uh, I'd like to see a little bit more of that. Um, it also would be nice if they added some more orbs to this, like elite orbs instead of the uh, just the orange gear orbs because you can't always 100% stuff uh, to get them. But anyway. So, yeah, that's it. That's some D4 raiding. Uh, not too bad with that team. Um, I think my team... Uh, as far as, you know, the uh, raid team goes, you can see here, 6 red, 6 gold, black bolt at 103k, maw is 6 red, 6 gold with 101k power, Thanos is 100k power uh, with only 5 red, um, I still haven't maxed his ult, I probably should do that, it's only 30% more damage, so it doesn't really seem like that big of a deal to me. <laughs> <laughs> Symbiote is 5 red, 5 gold at 93k with all abilities maxed. And then uh, Minerva is 5 red, 6 gold uh, with only her passive max. So I really like her passive because, you know, as people die and she gets more um, turn meter and stuff. Um, but it's really the, the max is for Hela. So if you, when you have her with Greg, it uh, fills her speed bar 5% faster every time Greg dies, which is a lot. And if you can get double Gregs, then the two of them are just amazing together. So um, anyway, you don't need this ability if you're not running Hella with her. But I used her for DD3. That's why I uh, had the, had that max. But anyway, that's where we're at. Um, good, good, uh, you know, 480-ish K raid team that just kicks a lot of ass so so far uh it hasn't been so bad but uh we'll see how it goes when we bump it up to 100 uh, percent d4 and uh <laughs> we'll see how that goes so uh thanks for watching and i'll see you later